Hey guys, it's Jana, and today I am going to clean my Roomba. I will also do a little review of my opinions of my Roomba there at the end. Uh, so stay tuned for that. But this thing is pretty gross. We gotta clean this thing out. Do you see all that? Holy. You think we have a bunch of dogs and a couple girls with long hair around here? Woo! I was wondering why it wasn't working so great. <laughs> now I know. So I'm gonna take this thing apart, clean it up, and get it running smoothly, and I'll tell you what I think about it. So go ahead and hit subscribe, thumbs up, check all the links down below. Let's clean up Mr. Roomba today.
Wow, that was really embarrassing. I have not cleaned this thing since I got it. I never really even thought about it. I don't know why, but yeah, that was really gross. All right, so on to my review of my Roomba. I have model 650. So it's not one of the newer ones. It's, it's quite a bit older. I think there was like, I don't know, four or five newer models before we even got this thing. I think it works really good. The newer ones are probably better because they have like the Wi-Fi and the sensors. And not that the Wi-Fi really matters. I guess you can like tell it to start from your phone when you're like at work and stuff. But this does have a scheduler, a timer, and all that good stuff. I do not use that because we have dogs because if there is an accident around the house, apparently if it, a Roomba runs into an accident, it doesn't stop. So you can only imagine what happens. Yeah, that kind of scared me with the scheduler thing, so I'm not doing that part. If you don't have dogs and stuff, why not? Just have it running while you go to work or whatever. I do not think at least this model does as good of a job as I do with an actual vacuum. This one is quite random. Goes wherever it wants. There is no, you know, strategic up, down, down or anything. It's just kind of all over the place. So there's always spots that I'm like, yeah, Roomba didn't make it in here. And then it's super fun actually to watch it. Sometimes it's really funny because it'll get stuck in the bathroom or it'll get stuck under the dining room with all the chairs and stuff. So it's actually pretty funny. I want to get like a uh, GoPro or something and just put it on top of it and just see where it goes. I think that would be funny, but that's quite an expense just for one little funny thing. I think it is wonderful as far as like in between actual cleanings, like I can run this thing every day, picks up all the dog hair and dust bunnies and, and any little thing in between all the crumbs and stuff from, you know, the kids eating in the dining room and all of that stuff. So it is definitely a time saver in between, you know, actual cleaning the floors because I don't have time to vacuum the floors every day. I don't know anybody who has time to vacuum floors every day. So all in all, I really do like my Roomba. It is very helpful in between my cleanings, but it is quite expensive for a vacuum cleaner that is only good for like in between cleans. You know what I mean? Like my shark vacuum, it's like, what, 130, 150 bucks or something, and it works amazing. So expense-wise, I think it's quite expensive for what you get out of it. Now, again, this is the older model, so maybe the newer ones are kind of more strategic and don't miss spots. So I am happy that I did get it for the in-between cleanings. I just kind of wish it was a little bit more cheap and or worth its cost, if that makes sense. So that is my take on my Roomba. Uh, let me know if you guys have one, if you guys have one of the newer ones, I would love to hear uh, if they are a little bit more efficient and if it is actually worth it. So let me know in the comments down below. I'm also super interested in the iRobot Mop one. My husband's grandmother actually has it and I got a lot of tiles, so I gotta tell you, mopping is not my favorite thing to do. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. It takes forever. I mean, you saw the last two floor videos. That was a long time. It took a long time. I don't like it. So let me know if you have one of those mop robot things and let me know how that works out for you because that sounds very interesting. So thank you so much for watching. Go ahead and hit subscribe, thumbs up, check all the links down below, and I will see you next time.